Hi everyone, it's Cesar Tristan Lopez, and today we'll be talking about the Heian period regarding literature, culture, and art. The Heian period was known as the Golden Age of Japanese culture. During this time, court life was extremely important for both men and the women. The court men of this time usually worked in government while their literature strength was in Chinese. The reason for this is because Chinese was known as the more sophisticated language. Court women usually wrote literature and wrote many stories in hiragana and kana. Hiragana and katakana were developed because it was looked down in Japanese culture for women to learn Chinese. One of the literary geniuses of the time, Sei Shonagon, was a woman who served under the Empress Taishi and was superior in her knowledge and proficient in her use of kanji. She later then wrote The Pillow Book. The Pillow Book depicts the court life of a woman with sarcastic commentaries on contemporary matters and taste. The main feeling that Shonagon tries to express within the Pillow Book is the feeling of okashi, which means a delight in the novelty of court life. Her writings in the Pillow Book teaches later generations about the daily life of the aristocracy and how women should be properly courted by a lover during the Heian period. Another key figure in Heian literature was known as Murasaki Shikibu. She was proficient in her use of kanji and was also a superior in her knowledge. She later then wrote the work known as The Tale of Genji. The Tale of Genji is regarded as the world's first true novel and the first psychological novel ever written. The Tale of Genji serves to probe the psychological, romantic, and political workings of Japan. This idea was known as the stream of consciousness that was born due to the influence of women writers during the Heian period. During the Heian period, music was a huge part of the culture and art during the time. Gaku is known as the oldest form of classical music in Japan and was introduced from Buddhism from China. Here is a quick little 15 second segment of what Gagaku sounds like. Pure Land Buddhism offers salvation through the belief in Amida Buddha. This branch of Buddhism became popular in Japan during the Fujiwara Regency. Amida Hall, which is a new form of a Buddha Hall, is different because it blends the secular with the religious and houses one or more Buddha images within a structure resembling the mansions of nobility. This temple in Uji to the southwest of Kyoto is one of the finest examples of Fujiwara Amida Halls in Japan today. From the literature, culture, and art described here in this presentation, the Heian period is still considered the golden age of Japanese culture. This is Cesar Tristan Lopez, and thank you for listening to my presentation in the Heian period regarding literature, culture, and art. Thank you!